Gaster is disguised as Trashy and will be the final boss of Deltarune. First, I will recount the items of evidence I covered previously. Trashy has the meta-knowledge, have no friends. He tells you about this Bampton to the west and tells you about the Addisons who give this Bampton backstory about garbage noise. Even deeper, we see further ties to the secret bosses as both of them are represented by things but that are normally discarded. Future secret bosses may be the flowers in the trash can or the goner body you discard at the beginning. It would be funny if there was a default blender cube boss, but Toby Foggs would never do such a thing. What Tony totally does do as such a thing as making the funny guy character secretly epic. Remember the two seconds you thought Flowey was just like a funny little guy? Oh shit, that's the final boss of Neutral Row. Oh shit, that's Asriel Dreamer and one of the most important characters of the story. Imagine how unhinged that one would have sounded. And whoa, you're telling me Sans Undertale is the hardest boss in the game? What the funny skeleton and spam tone? Neil? Ah, uh, Sp Spamton was funny too at first. He can't keep getting away with making the joke character the final boss, but he's totally getting away with it this time. Tr trashy. <laughs> His name is literally Blue. And you know what else we see blue text in the game? When you hack the game to use Snowgrave on Spamton. His name is Blue. His name is Blue Me Spamton of Gaster. Big shot. I received a phone call in REM driving me. So all of this is happening to entertain someone, someone who's controlling you, so then why aren't you in a more entertaining scenario? First of all, it's kind of weird that Trashy has meta-knowledge of the recruit system. Darker, yet darker. So for if it, forget this, please. Newbert. <laughs> Newbert.